Hello there, Paul Lucido with another Take 5. I got a great book for all of you, and I hope you're going to like it. The book today we're going to discuss is called F the Funnel. That is right, F the Funnel. Let's get going. With over 20 years experience, Jeff Pedowitz, Forbes featured author, president and CEO of the Pedowitz Group, has helped over 1,500 clients successfully transform legacy revenue models in a customer-centric digital world. Now we all currently live in a digital world now, right? And navigating this space, and especially those of us that are marketers, this could be a little bit tricky and a whole new sort of environment for us. That being said, F the Funnel, provocatively titled by the way, disposes of old ideologies and the overused standard ROI funnel in place of a modernized customer-centric marketing solution that effectively embraces their customers' needs and desires through a journey of transformation to ultimately becoming clients for life. Now let's stop there. We all know that the uh, old marketing funnel, in fact, these are the marketing funnels that have been used for, for many, many years, acquires from the top down, right? So basically you start by bringing the customer into the funnel, you take them through various stages, and ultimately the uh, end all be all is to close the deal. And what happens? You move on to the next customer, right? With a closed funnel system with kind of like, I would like to call it a Mobius strip, or perhaps an infinity loop, you're actually bringing the customer in and you're taking them through a cycle. And it's a continuous cycle. This cycle actually creates what we call a client for life experience. And a lot of this, again, is done through um, client acquisition, client retention, and expansion. So it's kind of a continuous stage of, um, of like four different stages per each side of the loop. Jeff also plays to the heartstrings of marketers like myself, people that are navigating the digital strategy space, and things of that nature. Ultimately, you know, sometimes it's been said that marketing sometimes suffers from not really being quantifiable, that a lot of times marketing teams are not really valued as much as they really should be. Now, that doesn't necessarily speak for everybody because I can honestly tell you based on my own personal experiences that we've found a way to um, quantify, if you will, how marketing does bring value and that's in the way of brand awareness that's in the way of um, you know building brand equity through culture and cultural alignment these are things that I've talked about in the past one of the things that uh, I did like about the book that on a personal level that I felt like Jeff really connected with uh, with me was he kind of hit some of the pain points uh, some of the emotional uh, points that we go through um, as marketers, as leaders, um, you know, running departments. Uh, the biggest thing is, you know, getting the ROI. You hear that used a lot, the return on investment. And, you know, the question, are we loved? Are we literally, um, you know, you know, we're bringing our A game and what's the return on investment? You know, is it really paying dividends? Is it, uh, is it being acknowledged? These are things that we do go through, especially when you're in the creative side of the business too, because you're really putting yourself out there. You're really opening yourself up uh, to become comfortable with being uncomfortable. And that's not easy to do. But with that being said, I gotta tell you, uh, this book is brilliantly written and it's a must read for every CEO and CMO and digital strategist looking to remain relevant in today's landscape and especially a landscape of digital disruption. So with that, I'm going to go ahead and close and just tell you that um, you can pick up this book on Amazon and uh, it's reasonably priced. Um, there's a whole list of testimonials from others that read the book that are of marketing CMO level, C-suite level folks, digital strategists out there. And uh, they all have some great things to say about Jeff and about what he's done. Um, and again, my goal will be to uh, meet with Mr. Pedowitz um, hopefully eyeball to eyeball and where we can discuss the book, dig a little deeper and uh, have some fun. And with that, this is Paul Lacido and I will see you in the next Take 5.